For clarification, Y chromosomal Adam is the name given to the most recent common ancestor of all currently living human males. Homo sapiens are believed to have first appeared around 300,000 BCE based on analysis of the Y chromosome, known rate of Y chromosome mutations over time, hominin DNA comparisons and based on fossil evidence found in Jebel Irhud, Morocco in 1967. According to evolutionary science, hominids have existed for at least 6 million years, with Homo erectus emerging roughly 2 million years ago, marking the start of our evolutionary link to a common hominin, Homo heidelbergensis. This means modern humans have only existed for approximately 5% of the entire hominid lifespan. It may be fair to say that we are a relatively new addition to the diverse tree of life. We are led to believe that our evolutionary explosion has occurred naturally, while great ape species like the orangutan have remained relatively stable for the past 15 million years. To put that into perspective, Homo sapiens have existed for 2% of the orangutan's evolutionary lifespan, yet we have evolved exponentially faster. This is just one example that challenges conventional evolutionary theory, but we can find many more if we look at other species. Horseshoe crab species have lived almost exactly as they were 445 million years ago. Crocodiles date back to 200 million years. Goblin sharks date back to 125 million years. But the list goes on and on. And we continue to identify examples of species that have not adhered to the fundamental principles of evolution. Do the evolutionary requirements for genetic adaptation not apply to other species? Or is something else occurring? Consider or contemplate this as we continue our journey for the truth.